Good morning. So it is Sunday, May 7th. You are getting my wake up hair and it's full glory. Um, I have another abbreviated weekend this weekend and instead of filming a regular traditional podcast episode, I thought I would vlog a little bit on my one day off today. Josh and I actually went out last night. We don't go out a lot, but we went out after work because I had a really long day yesterday at work. We had margaritas and snacks and we are feeling the ill effects this morning. So we're a little slow moving, but uh, we're gonna take Gracie for a walk here in a few minutes. Pardon the, the mess of shoes next to my bed, real life here. No, no podcast uh, uh, glory here, just all messy shoes. Hi Grace, and here's Josh. Gracie, do you wanna go for a walk? Do you wanna go for a walk? Well, we are going to get going. Bye. Josh and I always <laughs> think Gracie likes to poop on church property. She's a very sacrilegious dog. For some reason, she really likes to do her business on one of two churches that is a few blocks in each direction from our apartment. And what was I just telling you? I'm sorry if this offends you. If you are especially religious, it's just, this happens every day. No exaggeration. So we are walking. Gracie likes to go to houses and approach them like we live there. We decidedly do not live in this beautiful home. Josh has his coffee. Oh, wait. Is this uh... is all is right in the world. Oh no, this is we're, we're no, this is the house. Is it? That no, is the house. Oh, yeah. Cool. The thing about working in news is when Hello. you tend to report on stories a lot uh, and you talk about where people live, you're like, oh, that's the house where the guy was indicted for the Ponzi scheme, and now he's in prison. So that house we just walked by was the Ponzi scheme house. Okay. Approaching the dog park where. Gracie doesn't go in because she's not really a dog's dog. She's more of a dog for humans, but she likes to go to the fence and look at animals like she's at the zoo. So that's what we'll probably do. Dogs are Josh has made friends with a kitty cat and I'm slowly approaching with Gracie. Hi, kitty. It's a beautiful he's kitty cat. cat. I know. Like, I Maybe he's dog. just really friendly. Hi. Gracie's like, can I just play with the... I want to play with it. Come on, Grace. We'll go this way. Oh, Josh has a walk buddy. He's going to lead the way, apparently. It cut off right in the middle of our meeting that orange cat with a ridiculous collar. So we... Um, it was fine with Gracie, you know, we, a few years ago, we met a cat on a walk, not on that street, you know, probably eight or nine blocks away, and the cat was sitting on the front porch, and it came at Gracie, and was very aggressive, and was like doing the equivalent of like, come at me bro, come on, let's fight, let's do this, so we're a little wary when cats approach with such, um, laser focus toward the dog so um but this cat was so sweet and um really wanted josh to pet it and he followed us for about three or four houses and finally i said okay josh i think we need to like jog a little bit down the blocks to get this cat to not follow us the whole way home instead of going to the gym i think we're going out to breakfast so because i have a one day weekend and because i worked out like six days last week I am having no problem with this justification to myself, not one bit. So we are headed to uh, Hair of the Dog for breakfast. Bye. Josh got strawberry pancakes. I did. I have a mountain of French toast. Yum. And bacon and grits. Oh, I'm wait, it's, my, it's green. I'm it's... gonna do my robot <laughs> to the 
crosswalk sign. As soon as it goes, it's green. It's green. It's gonna take a second here because it knows how exciting this moment is. This is the anticipation right here. The universe is excited about this. I'm waiting. Your battery's gonna run out while we're waiting for this thing. <laughs> oh, because there's a turn signal that we gotta wait on. Okay, here we go. Here it is. One die and on. One die and on. One die and on. Here's the machine gun. 30. 29. Oh god, I have to do 30 moves. 26. 25. 24. You know what this is really useful for? The people waiting at the red light over there. <laughs> <laughs> they get I to enjoy the show. Watching me last time. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you want me to do this? No, don't. That does not help. That makes everyone sick. <laughs> Here it comes. Home stretch. Nicely done. Hey there. So I am showered. My hair is all curly again. And we're home from breakfast. Well, I'm home. Josh had to go into the office for a little bit to work on some stuff. And I am settling in for a little bit of knitting. I have brownies in the oven because I have to work tomorrow. And tomorrow's the first day of one of the two interns that I manage. And I wanted to have a treat for his first day. So brownies it is. So while the brownies are baking, I am going to keep working on a sock for my brother. Josh and I might go see Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 this evening, and I want to make sure, as any good knitter does, I want my knitting to be in a place where I can take it to the movie and knit on it in the dark. So here's what we're looking at. I finished the first sock a few days ago. Not on May the 4th, I finished it a few days before May 4th. So I finished the first sock. This is mustache yarn in the R2-D2, the droids colorway, technically. Um, it's droids, but it's really supposed to look like R2-D2. And I am on the toe of sock number two. So I have a little bit way of a ways to go, but I wanna finish the toe so that I can start the pattern, the sock, self-patterning yarn um, at, before I get to the movies tonight. So that's what I'm working on. Um, we're headed to a Chinese restaurant for dinner, so that'll be really yummy. Um, it's been a nice, quiet day. Josh went for a nice walk. Yep. And it's nice yeah, out it's too. been it's really, such a nice it's weather. really nice. It's like 60 out. degrees out. There was about 87.3 million dogs in the dog park. Yeah, more been, dogs than this morning. Yeah, no, it was, yeah, it was basically like a dog pack. <laughs> a dog gang, if you yeah. will. Mm, they were ganging up. Jets and sharks. It was quite a bit of uh, barking and mm -hmm. howling. And the General kids, tomfoolery. Yeah, the kids were a little, little rambunctious. Mm. Sugar in their cereal, I think. <laughs> It is 8 o'clock on Sunday night. Um, Josh and I are home from dinner. I was a bad vlogger. I didn't record anything while we were out at dinner. We sat at the bar at P.F. Chang's and it was just really packed. It was shoulder to shoulder. I felt weird about it. So we went to P.F. Chang's, then we got ice cream, came home, took the dog for a walk. So it was a really nice relaxing evening. I think I'm gonna wrap this vlog up, try and edit it tonight before bed. So I hope to be back probably midweek, the week of the 15th if possible. Um, I'm going to Ohio next weekend to see family, to see my baby niece. So my recording might be something similar. It might be more vlogging style next week. I just don't know. So I will also save the selection of prize winners for our knit along the love yourself cow i'm gonna save that for next episode or the one after as well so thanks for bearing with me today guys this was kind of a piecemeal episode i hope you had a fantastic weekend and i'll talk to you soon bye